morning, it's Jennifer. It's my P3 day eight, and I was down 1.2 this morning. What? Oh, I'll take it. There's no complaints here, that's for sure. I, uh, it's cold. It's negative five right now. 14 degrees in my garage and I'm watching the temperature of my car external temperature just drop as I go up block after block <laughs> well now it's about 10 <laughs> um so yesterday I had my I told you what I had for lunch already I at dinner time was not hungry so I had um, nothing until it was like 8 o'clock, 8.15, <laughs> we got home and I made, um, heated up some of that Kahlua, Kahlua pig and had that with some of the cabbage I made with it. That was really delicious. The cabbage mixed with that pork is just really good. So I had just a little, little small bowl of that and didn't even heat all that I put in there. So. And then, oh, why do I do this to myself? Why do I do this? So, Pop-Tarts are so bad for you. <laughs> my daughter wanted some. What kind does she want? Oh, my favorite kind, frosted cherry. Damn it. So I had a Pop-Tart last night also, because I was just craving it. It sounded delicious, nice toasted up and caramelized sugar on that thing uh-huh yeah it really wasn't as good as I you know remembered them because I don't think I've had like a pop tart in like five years something like that maybe longer long time so anyway oh driving into work now it's cold so I told my Fitbit group, but I, I didn't post a picture or whatever. I bought these shoes off of um, eBay that I've been looking for. I had them when I was pregnant with my um, youngest. I had a black pair and a brown pair. They're born uh, leather, like not even like a full back on the shoe. It wasn't like a mule kind of, but didn't have a full back on it. Slide your foot right in and out. Easy. I used to have to wear those when I was pregnant with her because it was the only shoes that I could really fit my foot into because of the swelling. <laughs> I'm so swollen. Anyway, I wore them out. I wore mine out. So I was like, that would be kind of nice to get a pair of those again. So I was looking. Can't find them. Can't find them anywhere. Found a pair on eBay. From Canada. Canada's not as far from me, <laughs> but shipping's a little expensive. So I was excited when I got here. I wore them for like an hour that the day I got them or the next day or whatever. Um, brand new. I mean, the, the heels were, or the soles of them were just completely clean. No scuffs, no nothing. Hadn't been worn. Wore them on Friday to work all day. And went to the Children's Museum, not museum, the Children's Theater to go see Cinderella. We were there a little bit early, we sit down, and I look down and it's like freaking shoes coming apart. Like bad. It's like it was uh like it was old rubber. It was like just cracking and pulling apart from the leather on the shoe, the stitches, all of it. It was just a hot mess. And it was, I'm like, oh my God, please just stay together until uh, I get back to the car. Because <laughs> I envisioned myself having to walk back to the car barefoot. Truth. So, anyway, it did. Stayed together. That was good. Except I had to, um, so I took a, I did take a picture, sent it to the lady who I bought it from was like, what the heck? And uh, she 
you know, nicely refunded my purchase price, but not obviously shipping. It wasn't her fault. Um, they looked fine. They looked fine when I got them. I wouldn't have worn them all day, you know? So anyway, it was just kind of a crazy, <laughs> crazy ordeal. So it's so funny driving and looking like, oh look, someone took out that light, that, that sign. <laughs> driver's license from. This guy's going to take this corner. Hi. Yep. It helps to scrape off your car, your windows, so that you can actually see other cars. I'm just saying. I remember those days of having to park outside and dealing with that, not having a garage. So anyway, my ear's feeling better today. out like the side of the I'll just go all the way over my lane over here. Oh it's a truck pulled over there. I thought they were like sweeping the snow off the side because it was like smoke everywhere. But I guess when it's you know negative five it's cold. I gotta bring in my car because I got a remote start on it. But it doesn't work. It's like I push the button and you hear it goes start it, but it never fully turns over the ignition. So when it sits there and drains the battery, running the, you know, the vent and the uh, radio and lights and all that stuff, so it sucks to be an adult, doesn't it? But yeah, my ear's better, it's been draining, so that's pretty attractive. So I'll be probably walking around with a tissue in my ear this afternoon. Oh, but anyway, but that's getting better. I only had like close calls or falls just like three times yesterday. So the last one was a uh, noonish. So it helped, I think, laying down on it and to help get fluid out. Oh, it's a truck up there that has snow on top of it. Blizzard. <laughs> oh, traffic isn't bad today at all. Everybody's, you know, you know what's car started? Everyone complained about not wanting to go to work in the cold. Alright, well that's my update for today. I don't really have much to say. My daughter's got dance tonight, so I'll take her and get my 45 minutes of walking in. I did not meet my step goal yesterday. I was close, but I did not meet it. I did some walking last night, but you don't walk a lot. I was walking very fast, so it's just really of a slow walk. It's boring after a while. I do have a couple of vlogs in my queue I need to watch, so I'll be looking forward to doing that tonight with my walking. And that's it. I hope everybody is having a great day. Stay warm. Don't be wearing shorts today, people. Unless I guess you're in Florida, you probably can get away with it there. But the rest of the country, I don't think it's, I don't, I think it's too cold everywhere else. All right, bye guys.